Hello, uh, I'm Don Benjamin. I'm, I teach Biblical and Near Eastern Studies in the Department of Religious Studies on the Tempe campus and online, which is now part of the School of Historical, Philosophical, and Religious Studies. Um, I did my graduate degree at Claremont Graduate University in religion, and so in addition to my field, I teach general area courses about the American religious tradition and uh, how to use how social scientists, anthropologists, sociologists, archaeologists look at religion, which is different than, say, theologians. I began my teaching career at Rice University in Houston and spent most of my career there which is a 1500 undergraduate campus and um, then I've been here at ASU at the Tempe campus for the last 15 years. I I'm very passionate about undergraduate teaching. I'm a sore loser. I mean I I'm realistic. Not every student finds their way to learning with me but I really hate to lose them and I found for example, the traditional term paper was not only, uh, you know, a one-shot sudden death for the student, but it also depressed me, you know, to go through a whole semester with a student and then at the end ring a, re read a single paper. And the second thing is I'm an author. I'm, I've written six books for my guild in my career, and so teaching my students how to do directed research is important to me. And so the scaffolding lets me look at their work just like an editor or a mentor would look at their work throughout the semester. So they need to focus on a topic, create a proposal, do at least two reports and sometimes more during the semester. And I mean it, it allows me more opportunities to advise them. Uh, to help them learn the tools of write, research writing and um, and I enjoy it more you know because I know long before the end of the semester who's learning and who isn't learning. Well in uh, the assignments report in two ways. One is uh, on a uh, word process document as it goes through and the other is with PowerPoints. So with the word process document there's a process of topic selection which they do on a discussion board, then a one-page proposal which they do in a Dropbox, um, and then the next steps have to do with teaching to use research databases to find material on their topic. Um, one of my goals, I mean, I want them to learn from me, but I don't want them to leave me thinking I'm the only, whatever I do with the topic or the material is the only thing done. So typically the scaffolding includes them reporting back to me what they understand that I have taught them. Now it's not just regurgitating it because they have to talk it in their own words. And then the second or the next step is to use 